Hello everybody, this is an old Olivetti PC built from 1983 to 1989 by Olivetti, so it has 40 years now. This PC costed about 6 million lire in January 1986, around $4,500 now. It was a PC for office use. But of course uh, you could also use it for playing the first game on PC. It seems somewhat uh, similar to the current PCs, uh, but of course uh, there are many differences. It uses big uh, 5.25 uh, inch floppy disks and uh, hard disk to maximum capacity of uh, 10 megabytes. This is a comparison with uh, current uh, uh, hard disk 3 terabyte very different you see at uh, those times uh, software and games uh, were uh, on these uh, so called uh, floppy disks uh, i have still many games uh, on these uh, old uh, 5.25 inch uh, floppy disks tetris pacman risico karate barbarian Test Drive, Sonics, Sin City, Grand Prix Moto. Some of these made the history of the PC games. But before I start playing in next videos, I'd like to show this PC. The video it's not a flat LCD video. But it's a green screen video, CGA, color graphic adapter. Here there are the regulations. The resolution is uh, uh, 320 by 200. This is uh, to have an idea of the differences uh, with modern videos. Also here, there is a lot of difference, you see. The video connector is this. It's very different from modern HDMI or DisplayPort. There are some slots to connect additional cards. For example, additional communication cards, double serial cards or graphic cards with 16 colors. At those times, a graphic card with uh, 16 colors was uh, exciting. Today it's, it's uh, not so exciting since uh, modern TV has uh, millions of colors. Here in the back uh, there is also a 25 pin serial port and a parallel port to connect a printer, a printer like this. The connector on the printer was the Centronix connector. It was a cable like this. And these are all cables uh, for the connection of the M24. This is the connector for the keyboard. It, it's not a serial port, it's a connector specific for the keyboard. You cannot use a USB keyboard, of course. USB ports didn't exist. On the keyboard there is a connector to connect the mouse. Olivetti N24 has its own dedicated mouse, so you cannot use a normal 9-pin mouse like this. Do you remember it? The mouse of that period had the ball inside, not a laser connector. You had to open the mouse and clean the inside, once a week at least. Let's turn on the PC, see what happened. The PC is starting and it's checking its internal issues. You see that the CPU is 8086. It's the first processor at 16 bit and it's 8 MHz. We see it has a little more than 500K RAM. The operating system is MS DOS. It's not on the hard disk, and the PC complained because he didn't find it. So I need to use the floppy disk with the operating system. 
These are the Oliverty floppy disks with MS-DOS, the operating system of those period. Insert the floppy disk in the floppy disk reader and close the lever. Now the PC is happy and ready to go. Each of us has memories of the first electronic devices used. This is one of the first electronic devices I played with. The games were very simple, but I enjoyed it a lot. I also worked with it because my father was an Olivetti wall sellers and I also trained as computer technician, formatting 10 MB hard disk, changing floppy disk 5.25 inch, expanding computer memory from 256k to 512k, soldering the memories on the board, etc. In one of the next videos we will see the inside of the PC M24 and more interesting I will play again after tens of years with these games on floppy disks. So what can I say? Have a nice day and thanks for watching.